Carson Wentz has one more year left to prove that he's a starting quarterback in the NFL. That's, that's my honest initial reaction now that he's been traded from Frank Reich in Indianapolis to the Washington Commanders that he's going to have one season left to prove that he is capable of being a starting quarterback in the NFL. In the same week that two future Hall of Fame quarterbacks cemented where they'll be playing, the Washington Commanders, still haven't gotten used to that, went out and secured the services of Carson Wentz. Lord have mercy. A quarterback somehow even less inspiring than the name Commanders. Let's be clear about that. Washington fans are horrified about adding a quarterback who is a disaster waiting to happen on every damn snap. But the rest of the NFC East, oh, they're loving this. They're loving this, okay? Dallas cornerback Trayvon Diggs is salivating over the turnover possibilities. You know he is, okay? Philly fans are celebrating the chance to boo Carson Wentz and Ben Simmons. And Giants fans, Giants fans. Y'all got problems of your own. Y'all better sit this one out. It's been a fast fall for Carson Wentz, no doubt about that. The number two overall pick an MVP candidate, a monster contract in Philadelphia, people debating if Wentz or Dak Prescott was the best quarterback in the NFC East to this, to a debate if he's really even better than the muffler man himself, Taylor Heineke. That's how bad it's got for Carson Wentz. To Frank Reich, the one man who vouched for Wentz, helping him pack up and leave Indianapolis. Now don't get it wrong. This is Wentz's last chance to write a new ending to his career. But I have a feeling it's going to end the same as his time with the Colts did. I've seen evidence, no evidence to the contrary. No evidence to the contrary. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.